Hey, what's good people, it's Vitas Tech, and we finally have a real case in-house for the Google Pixel Pro 9 Fold. Huge shout out to Tungate, not for sending it out for review, but for creating a real case for the Pixel 9 Pro. It has been a famine when we've been looking for cases for this phone, but it seems like we finally have some real protection for the Pixel 9 Pro Fold. Coming in at $60, this is a full 360 coverage case for the Pixel 9 Pro Fold. Let's go ahead and get it out of the box. Now, before you get to the case, you do get a little letter. That's always nice to see. You have, so it does look like this case is using adhesive. So, all right, one minor strike against it, one minor strike. You have your installation package. You have your warranty card and also how you're supposed to install the adhesive, your extra adhesive strips, and how you're going to install the case. But, yo, we're, we, we, we experts at this point in the game. <laughs> All right. So, like I said, this is a full 360 coverage case, meaning you're getting the case itself, you're getting hinge protection, and you also have... A temper glass screen protector and that doesn't feel that bad at all but honestly I don't know if this case is gonna be any different because I always and I mean always peel off the temper glass so we'll see if this is any exception let's go ahead and take that off and one two so there is let's see tap tap so it's all right not the best but it's all right you're getting a one-stop shop now from the front piece you can see there is one two looks like three pieces of adhesive on the inside of the front cover and on the back there is so there is no adhesive strips on the inside of the case you only have to deal with three adhesive pieces on the inside of the case so not that bad we can live with that we can live with that so let's go ahead and peel off the first one. There's one. I can get in there. There's two. And I am not able to reach that. Am I really going to have to pause the video just to get to it? There we go. All right. So we can continue. We got three pieces. So let's go ahead and give that a wipe down. Already got fingerprints all over it. So let me go ahead and wipe down the front of the phone now only three pieces of adhesive strips is not that bad at all if you've seen some of my other case videos there was like double digit adhesive strips so let's go ahead and pop that right in so one two we'll give it a nice little squeeze as i turn on my camera all right i don't know what happened there but give that a nice little squeeze so boom boom and then we will go ahead and install the back piece. So line it up with the camera, snap it in, very satisfying click in, and there it is. Now, I will say it does add quite a bit of bulk to the phone, but this is a protective case. What else do you expect? Quick tour. You have your mic cutout at the top. You have your speaker cutouts. On the left side, you have your full hinge protection. You can see a little bit of company branding right there tongate if you can't see it i will do some b-roll but what's cool about this it is also a kickstand so you do have a little kickstand right here and of course on the back side you have your camera which is also another kickstand so you have two different ways to use the kickstand when it comes to this case quick tour at the bottom mic cutout speaker cutout type c mic you have your volume buttons over here. Volume down, volume up. Now the buttons aren't super tactile. You're not gonna have that nice, you're not gonna hear that nice little click if that's what you're into, but they do feel somewhat tactile. When it comes to the power button, completely exposed, not being blocked in any way. Works on both fingers without an issue. And yeah, like I said, on the back, you have your camera protector which does have padding on the inside and it also has 
wireless charging in MagSafe. So first, let's start with the MagSafe. Let's start with the wireless charge and see if that works. Throw it on the regular charger. Survey says, boom, it is charging up. You can see over there, up there in the corner, it is, wait, wait, it paused charging. Let me see if I get it in the right spot. All right, let's verify this. All right, so it looks like all is good. It, wait, no, whoa, whoa. All right, so we are having a little bit of trouble when it comes to wireless charging, at least with my wireless charger. You can see it's like struggling to find it. Let's see if I adjust it a little bit. Let's see what it does then. So now it is looking like it's steady. So you might just have to find the sweet spot on your charging pad so that may or may not be an issue depending on what type of wireless charger you're using double tap one more time to verify yep it is charging up just fine all right so let's go ahead and move on to the magsafe charger so we'll go ahead and clap it on the back nice strong char all right so look this case is heavy and it is not falling off in any way go ahead and roll it over you can see magsafe charging does work without an issue. Unlike the wireless charging where I had to like get it in the right spot, MagSafe, it went on, started working perfectly, just fine, so no issues with that. Now this is supposed to have second generation charging tech, so it's supposed to help charge that much quicker. We'll have to see how true that is, but they are claiming that it does have faster MagSafe charging, so Maybe we'll have to do a test with that. Stay tuned in the comments. I'll let you know if you have any questions about that. Hit me up. I'll let you know how I've experienced when it comes to charge speeds. Let's go ahead and try a MagSafe ring. So the MagSafe ring goes on and you can see it is not coming off. So the magnets on this case is extremely strong. No issues there. The case overall it's a soft filling case. I think we have a winner. <laughs> this case feels good. You have a little bit of texture on the kickstand and on the side on the hinge. So you are getting that hinge protection. So if you're worried about protecting your device, this, yo, I think we finally have a legitimate case for the Pixel 9 Pro Fold. Let's see when it comes to swiping. Let's see, let me just put in my passcode real quick. When it comes to like swiping, it's so on the left side, maybe a little bit of difficulty because, you know, this case does have like real lip going around the front of the phone. So you can put your phone face down with no issues there. Plus, you do have that tempered glass screen protector. You can see the screen is also still recessed down in there. So... Yeah, this case is actually pretty legit. Let's open it up. Let's get the device. So, yeah, fingerprint working just fine because it is fully exposed. Now, let's try the different angle. So, you can throw it up like that. So, the kickstand is very nice and durable. Let's see, throw it that way. And like I said, the camera is also a kickstand. So, you can throw it up that way. Let's tilt it there. Does that work? Not really, but maybe not. So if you want to use the kickstand when it's folded like that, watch your videos on the front. That works without an issue. Not so much. Let's see all the way. So yeah, definitely not so much when it's open. Definitely not. But when you have this one, so basically the camera kickstand is just used for when you're just using... The smaller display, no issues there. If you want to use it with the big display, you just simply open that one up, throw it right there, boom, no issues at all. Not budging. The kickstand does seem like it's very durable at different angles. So yeah, overall, you're getting full 360 coverage. The case actually feels really nice in the hand so no issues there you might have to deal with a little bit of fingerprints but that is not the worst i do not see any 
issues with this case. Now, like I said, it is coming in at $60, but at this point, yo, I think we have a real contender. Stay tuned, I do have a second case from Tungate. This is the more protective one. The other one does have a lot of protection, but this one is definitely the more protective one comes in one color this black kind of wish they had made more colors but i understand there's kind of an issue making cases for the pixel 9 pro fold right now but overall a really solid case you're getting full 360 coverage built-in tempered glass screen protector max safe charging which is supposed to be a little bit faster yo i think we finally finally have a winner for the pixel 9 pro fold let me know down in the comments what you think. It's VDust Tech. I'll catch you on the next one. Later.